wine. Uh. Hey, what's up, you guys, and welcome to the next duct tape video. This isn't gonna be like a normal order video like I normally do, cause this video is gonna be all about duct tape paintings that I've made. Now my duct tape paintings, I've never sold one, but I just like to make them for fun and I can hang them up on my walls or I can give them to people or whatever I want. So a couple of these are gonna be ones that I just made for myself and then two of them are gonna be ones that I'm sending to one of my, one of the YouTubers that I really like. So let's take a look. So this is the first duct tape painting I've ever made and most of you have seen it because it, I entered it in the duct tape stuff uh, contest for paintings. I didn't win, unfortunately, because nobody, I don't think anybody, like, voted for me, because I didn't really tell people that I was entering. Yeah, so this was the first one that I did. If you want me to go more in-depth on it, you can see it in my entry video. So the next one I have is an Angry Birds painting. So I've got the red Angry Bird with the green pig. Looks really nice. And then I put verses, just like I did on the other one. And then Angry Birds, and it's kind of, like, slanted lettering. Looks pretty nice. So the next one I made is a, like, I guess you'd say bigger version on the Rolling Stones wallet that I made. It is a Rolling Stones painting. I forgot, I need to do no fold over lines because I thought I was going to be okay, but it, you can obviously see that there's fold over lines. It looks kind of weird, so I'm going to fix that later. But other than that, it looks pretty nice. This was way easier to do than the wallet because it was just such a bigger, like, version. So yeah, that's pretty nice. So these next two are paintings that I'm hopefully going to be sending to a YouTuber called Zero Time Lost Zero. I've put up a lot of videos on, about him. Uh, I did one of him dancing and I did one of an intro for him. So uh, these two paintings are one of his like normal sayings that he d says like all the time. First one is Mountain Dur. That's what they call Mountain Dew obviously because it's the exact same logo but it says Mountain Dur. So that's pretty cool. It's on just a piece of black paper but I covered it in lime green tape and then it's like um it's like the mountain dew on a mountain dur on a white background then on a lime green background then on a of uh, uh, I guess we'd say like a forest green dark green and then it's forest green mountain dew and then red mount I mean forest green mountain red dur and the next one is pretty much like that but it's mountain dur curd rurd I know that sounds pretty weird if you don't know if you don't know like what these sayings came from you have to go watch his videos they're really funny and I think you should go check them out. So it's the basically code red version of Mountain Dew, but it's Mountain Dew Curd Word. So let's start up here. It's Black Mountain Red Dew on a white background, then on a chrome, then black, then red. Then down here is the Curd Word, which is white lettering on a black background, then on like a red circle, then a chrome one, then a, another red one. So I followed both of these designs really carefully to make sure that they looked really nice. So I'm hopefully going to be sending those to his P.O. box and hopefully he likes them. Okay, so I have one last painting to add into this uh, collection video. Uh, this is going to be hard to show so I'm going to pick up the camera. This is, again, for Zero Time Lost Zero. This is another Mountain Dur, but this one is a, like a kind of one that I made up. It's Mountain Dur YOLO. So if you listen to Lil Wayne music, you know what YOLO means, or Drake. Um, I'm not really going to explain it because it's not my thing to explain, but, um, they like Lil Wayne and Drake, so I thought I would make a whole new painting for them. It's gold, it's a black mountain red dirt, white border, gold border, black border, and then gold all around. And then the yellow is white lettering on black border, on, uh, gold on red. So yeah, I thought that looks pretty nice. So yeah, that was basically the, um, painting episode. I'm going to have, be having like a new order video pretty soon. I almost have enough wallets to make an order video. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that, and I will see you next time.